Well, good morning. My bag is packed and I'm now on my way to Heathrow Terminal 3 to start a journey to Japan for the first time to investigate what the region of Kumamoto has to offer. Of course, hosting two games in Rugby World Cup, France against Tonga and Wales against Uruguay. Going to be meeting up with Welsh and British and Irish legend Scott Quinnell. I'm fairly sure he's going to have far too much energy for this time in the morning. Anyway, bag is packed and off we go. So here in the uh, Japan Airlines lounge, ahead of catching the flight, and uh, oh, who's this? Hello, how are you? Former Welsh and British and Irish line, Scott Quinnell. Um, decided to invite him on a trip to Japan, as you do. Are you going to introduce me all week? Cause that's, uh, yeah, I reckon. It's just like being naked. Yeah. <laughs> um, been to Japan before? Never. Cannot wait. The culture, uh, the place, uh, the Kumamoto. Mm -hmm. uh, we go flying into Tokyo, go down to Kumamoto. Yeah. And can't wait to get down there and experience what the fans are going to be like come the end of the year. Yeah, we've got quite a busy itinerary. We're in the hands of Japan Airlines to get ourselves over there. So um, we'll see you in a bit. Well, here we are, arrived in uh, Tokyo, and we're going to a Kumamoto now. Two hour flight. This is a connecting flight. Easy peasy. Made it in plenty of time. Ah, just read the book and relax now before we get there. Well, here we are on the uh, shuttle bus on the way into town. We've just landed at Kumamoto. Scenery on the way in, pretty spectacular, right? It's absolutely incredible. Uh, you have a look at the, the, the mountain ranges coming right the way down. Japan's absolutely beautiful. And as we came in, we saw the volcano, we saw the smoke coming out of it. It was absolutely beautiful. Yeah, uh, amazing countryside. You get a real sense of the archipelago that, that Japan is and all of the islands on the way down. Um, and then a quick five, six pounds on the uh, on the bus shuttle into town. We'll be in the, in the center in about 45, 50 minutes. Well Scott here we are downtown Kumamoto. Um, I thought I'd bring you to a shopping centre. Happy with that? Uh, not really but I suppose this is where you can come and buy loved ones a gift for when you're going home but apart from that this isn't uh, this isn't my scene. I want to get out into the countryside. I want to go have a look at the castle tomorrow. I cannot wait. We've had a fantastic day with the governor and the mayor. They've made us feel so welcome. Yeah amazing. But we've got one more thing to do tonight. We're going to meet up with a couple of local people. They're going to show us around have a bite to eat, stay up as late as we can so we can have a good night's sleep tonight and we are hitting the road tomorrow morning. Good stuff. Well, we're here and looking forward to the adventures the town has to offer. They can't get enough of it. They're all into the rugby. Absolutely brilliant. Look at that. Cheers. Cheers. If you like your whiskies, you will love this. Absolutely love it. I think the towels are a little bit small. Konnichiwa. Konnichiwa. How's your hair, Scott? I haven't done anything to my hair. Lovely. That's Scott Quinnell. And that's Nick Heath. And you can watch our Rugby World Cup Fans Guide to Kumamoto on the Pundit Arena Facebook page.